Hey, it's Brickzar. I'm here to talk about a LEGO Ideals project that I would like you to go support. We'll put a link in the description to the LEGO Ideals project. It is this clockwork robot. It is by Webhead Studios, and all the information, the link, the links to the ideas and Webhead Studios will be in the description, as like I said, so be sure to check it out. I've been working a long time to get this thing finished. As his little arm thing up here has fallen. And uh, he sent me the PDF of the robot. And it actually includes two other builds, which I haven't had the time to build yet. So check those out. They are on the LEGO Ideas page. And that is pretty neat that it is a three-in-one. I wish I could show you all three of them. Maybe at a later time I will. He's only got 130 days or so left to get the 10,000 supporters. And so I'd like to see this project get that because it is a good project. It's a little different. It's colorful. It has the classic Lego uh, primary colors. You got your red, your blue, your yellow. So I, I like that. And it's uh, kind of reminds me of the robots from the Lego video game, Lego Island. And also we did get some clockwork robots in the classic or the collectible minifigure series. So this thing is posable. You can do all kinds of things with it. It's got movable arms, legs, the torso, and the head all spin and things. And I'll show you that. So here we go. We'll show you like the head can move. And it actually is on a one of those clickers so it kind of locks into place it's not free flowing so that's the back of the head you can also tilt it forward or back and of course the arms move you go all the way around and it's got three fingers which can grab things Maybe you want to put a minifigure in there. And then the torso can spin. And the legs can move. Now, I tend to break the back of it uh, when I try to move the legs too much. You can, they're really more designed to move outwards like that. And this, not, this right here, I have some defective... Um, robot arms they're um, they're actually I think the clutch on them is not very good because they should stick to those studs a little better so that's more me than the design here all right so let's see if I can there we go that came all right so you can move the legs it's got a hinge there so you can go this way I'll show you the back side. This gear actually is out of production. <laughs> so that would be cool if they'd make the set. I don't know why that gear is out of production. It's one of the most common gears. Now, there are two different versions of that type of gear. 24 tooth gear. It's got little gauges on the front. A lot of these little antennas. I like the use of the three primary colors. Oh, it's even got a little bit of green in it. Right there with that little stud there. Got a little vent on the side. But I think it's got a lot of potential because it's posable. You can turn the head. Who's touching me? Who broke my... Who, what happened there? Oh. That happens with everything I touch. But it's really neat. What do you think? Please support this project. Uh, we're going to incorporate it into some other videos. My son was already, as soon as I posted a picture of it on Instagram, he's like, we got to pose that attacking things or <laughs> something. So maybe we'll put it in a battle with some dinosaurs or so stupid or something. Because <laughs> it's posable. And unlike um, some other things, you can pose it and it'll hold the pose. So I, I kind of like that. Hey, little man. I'm not going to step on you. I promise. 
you see what fun you can have with this? I mean, you can just pose it. It's it's really, really great. And I think it would work good with uh, the dinosaurs. You know, I keep talking about it. Why don't I go get one? You see, I'm not worried about this Indominus Rex. He's about to clobber him in the head. So, you can have a lot of fun with this. Thanks for saving me from the Indominus Rex, clockwork robot. Isn't that Indominus Sue or something going on there? I don't know. Please support this legal ideals project uh, before I pass out.